Well, I think that uh, we have lost one of the best uh, human beings uh, our country ever produced. Kathy gave the best years of his life to the struggle, and uh, he went to, to uh, with the Rivonia trialist to Robben Island as a result of his role in the struggle outside of the country. But even on Robben Island, he remained a pillar of strength uh, towards very many other prisoners and uh, the leadership that was with him there, uh, and remaining faithful to the cause for justice until his release uh, in the early 90s. Uh, having come out of there, he continued to, to participate uh, with others to put the closing chapters, chapter of uh, to apartheid, and begin the task of laying the foundations for a new uh, democratic, non-racial uh, South Africa. I think that uh, that legacy will continue to inspire very many generations to come. I remember quite fondly how in the, between, in the years between 78 and 79, when we lived together in the same uh, uh, B section where they were always confined, uh, I learned uh, so much from him. His flair for detail, his uh, energy to do uh, duties that made for the morale of uh, prisoners, uh, always trying to find information, the news from old newspapers and so on, so as to inspire and motivate other prisoners. So yes, I am very, very sad that uh, today, before the end of the day, we will uh, take him to his final resting place because he will be buried in, according to Muslim rights, which means he must be buried today.